Hanging good, Jack. Mr. Jack. Mr. Jack. What is it, Gopi? Mr. Hing wanting you in a hurry lock. Fuck him. Fuck him? Yeah, you heard me. But Mr. Hing waiting two hours. Tell him I got small pot. Small pot? That's right. What's this? You've been playing at my desk again? No, Mr. Dan. You don't play. You don't play, huh? What's this? And this? Medicine? That's right, medicine. Mr. Gunstone, Jack Flowers here. So long I couldn't get back to you sooner. Yeah, what can I do for you, sir? Really? Oh, that's great, Colonel. Are you kidding me? Two thousand's a big help. <laughs> a whorehouse is always a good investment. Who? Jamila? Sure. Princess Hotel okay? Sure, you got it, sir. But Mr. Hank. Mm -hmm. Yeah, go. I know, Kobe. You're looking for me, Smiley? New man coming from Hong Kong, main office, ordered books, I'm out. What happened to the old man? Died, sick. This year, new man, Ang Mo. Ang Mo, Ang Mo. How would you like it if I called you a chink? Eh? Huh? You got no tact, you know that? Wasn't for me, you think any red-headed skippers would buy from you? What, because of your charm? You will meet at airport. Mr. William Lee, Ang Mo. My car's being fixed. You will meet 5 o'clock. I have to take a taxi. Bus. Now, you make the order to take a bus, you'll find something wrong with your books. Taxi. Look at this, a Geneva conference over four bucks. Why do you stand this shit? One night when he's asleep, jump on the bed and bite him in the neck. What the hell? They can't arrest you. Bus to airport. Taxi back. You want me to tell him about that other set of books? Okay, Andrew, you wait here, huh? How about the police? Do a song and dance. All right, Jack, I dance. The Aurora Cafe, the Pacific Airways, by Jack. Hey, Charlie, how's it again? Very good. What about the Deutsche Mark? Always good. Always good. And what about the dollar? Pretty good. Pretty good. Right here. Hey, buddy, oh, where are my cigars? Oh, Jack, I kept it for a month. Well, why didn't you call me? Oh, my wife killed me. Oh, your wife, your wife. Let me pay you for that. Oh, that's okay. You can keep. You can keep. Okay, can call keep. me next okay, time, thank for you. Christ's sake. Don't be afraid. My name's Jack Flowers. I work for Hing. Oh, how do you do? Let me give you a hand. No, no, really, thank you. Thank you. You're, um, you're not Chinese. No, I'm Italian. I mean, I wasn't born in Italy. My father was. Oh, I see. I was born in Buffalo. That's in New York, near Niagara Falls. Hi, Jack. Hey, honey, how you doing? You know how Buffalo got its name? Nothing to do with the animal. No, I... Yeah, uh, let me have that. Right. You had a long trip. Well, okay. well, the French were there first, you see. And uh, there's a river running through it, and they called it Beau Fleur. Beautiful river. Oh. So a couple of Texans must have gotten hold of it. Bofla, Bofla, Buffalo, you know? Oh, I see, they, um... What? They, um... Yeah. Oh. Prince's Hotel, Andrew. Yes. Nice place. I get a little kickback then. Oh, really? My word, it's hot, isn't it? Oh, uh, wow. This is Winterville. 
Uh, we're smack on the equator here. You've yeah, been to Singapore before, haven't you? No, I, I haven't, but I've always heard it's very... Uh, All right, let's go, Andrew. Very pleasant. Yeah, well, it depends on what you like. $500 fine, you know that? Not quite for that. That's right. Well, how's the weather in Hong Kong? Uh, well, actually, of course, it's a good deal cooler so, than... Uh, like, like something nice for tonight? Sorry? Go? As we show with two, go? To come a show, massage? Take it easy, Andrew. The man just got here. You want to kill him? No, I want him to feel home. Any of that interest you? Oh, oh, no, no, no. But in point of actual fact, I was wondering if... Uh, come on, don't be shy. Yeah, well, I wouldn't want to... Uh... Oh, come on, shoot. I mean, the uh, choice isn't very big. Most people don't realize that. It boils down to five. There's boys, girls, dirty pictures, exhibition, massage, combination thereof. Now, what did you have in mind? Well, I'd, I'd like to get a game of squash. Squash? Ah, oh, it's no problem. We have five places with courts. The Tangling Club, the Racket Club, the Country Excuse Club. Excuse me, I'm, I'm not... Look at this, the man can't breathe. He wants to play squash. I'm so sorry. Hey, you're not a squash player yourself, by any chance, are you? No, Bill, I drink. You drink? Well, I... William. William? Well, I, um, I take the odd drop. <laughs> Judy just left. Oh, she's so beautiful. Yeah, she yeah. is. The first time I saw her, I just put my hands on her face. Yeah, where's she from? Come from Ceylon. Uh -huh. The son of a bitch brick Chinese boyfriend. She come down to see him. And they put her on the street. Yeah, son of a bitch brick. Yeah, well, it's an old story, Judy. New to her. Bob? Yeah. I fixed old Colonel Gunstone up at Jamila. He'll be in uh, later. Oh, oh. Now, you make sure the air conditioning is working. Yeah. And if anything goes wrong with this ticker, what do you do? Uh, I'll call you. That's right. You'd be a very good friend of mine, Mr. William Lee. How are you doing, Mr. Now, we've got to have great A service today, Bob. Great A, Jack. Yeah, what'd you give him, an inside room or an outside, outside room? Outside room. No, too noisy. Nice view. Well, we've got to have an inside room. Right, William? The view stinks anyway. Jack? Yeah? I'll see you later. OK. Enjoy your stream, sir. See you later. Yeah. William, what's that? I pick you up at about 8 tomorrow morning. Right, right. fine. Oh, Jack. Yeah. Thanks so much for meeting me. Ah, oh, forget it. Can I buy you a drink? Why? Why not? Well, what shall I do about my young... Uh, take Mr. Lee's bag upstairs, will you? Are you sure you've got the time? As a matter of fact, I'm going to a place I think you like. Look, I don't want to intrude. You need some of your countrymen there. Really? Get yourself a game of squash. Well, after you, William. Oh, no, after you. Come on, don't be a pain in the ass. <laughs> Hey, how are you? How you doing, baby? How's business? Okay. Yeah? Well, that's good. How's the kids? Just fine, fine. Thank you. You're looking beautiful. You're not looking too bad yourself. Take care now. No, it's you're a punce, aren't you? Hard to say what anyone is. Well, I only mention it because, personally speaking, I can never bring myself to pay. William, people make love for so many crazy reasons. Why shouldn't money be one of them? Huh? Good. 
good. Business is good, Jack. Oh, it is. Huh? Uh, where can that I get a wash? Wash. A wash. Wash. A wash. wash. Guess is back in town. And she from Bangkok? That's right. I'd be here a couple of weeks. This week, very bad. Huh? Moving the office. I understand. I'll see you in two days. Well, any time. Listen, you want to buy my car? How are you going to get around? You're not going to drive it, are you? <laughs> Jack? What? You bring Coca-Cola girl to ship. Yeah, that's right. Too much. I hope people don't like it. What people? But they've been giving me the same dirty looks for 12 years now. Now, look, buy my car, 1500 OK, okay Jack. But you know start house. Well. Jack, Chinese people sometimes very awkward. Mr. Tan, you're a prince. Hey, boys. Are you to meet a friend of mine down from Hong Kong? Hawkers, how very agreeable. I thought you looked a bit stunned. Did you by any chance bump into a chum of mine called Bunny Pycroft in the honkers and shankers? Um, I don't believe I've had the An pleasure. An incredibly uh... nasty man, the vilest habits you could possibly imagine. <laughs> Dare say he's gone back to UK now for a spot of leave. Oh, did you ever get back to the UK yourself? Or... Oh, I used to. The last time I went back, they passed a bill making homosexuality legal. I said to my wife, let's get out of here before they make it compulsory. <laughs> <laughs> That's a friendly Jack. Yeah, I'll take care of what. You want a drink, William? Um, well... I don't believe we've met. Yardley. Uh, Lee. L-E-I-G-H. L-E-I-G-H, not L-W-E. I don't know. L-E-I-I-G-H. Oh, get that spelling, Froggy. Oh, don't be a cunt, Yardley. Just arrived, have you? Yes, an hour and uh, 40 minutes ago, to be precise. Well, I'd like to be precise. Don't be froggy. Certainly. Yes, Seeing we're sitting on the slag heap of life. It's always a bloody good thing to know the time of day. Now, Yardley is a philosopher, Jacko. Yeah, I noticed. What's your friend doing, Jack? What are you drinking, will you? Oh, let me think. Um, Plymouth Pink. Oh, oh Plymouth, Plymouth Pink. Pink. Do you want cherry in it? Are you a navy man? <laughs> Shall we pipe you no. aboard? How very agreeable. <laughs> Plymouth Pink. Gin and Angston. Or oh, Plymouth Pink. <laughs> Have you just come down from KL? No, no, Kong Hong. Kong Hong? Hong Kong. No, he's perfectly right. Kong Hong. Plymouth <laughs> 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 Pink. I was in Hong Kong a few years back. Couldn't stand the Foxy Blades. Do we still own it, Yatesy? Don't own anything. Mm. Well, I think I'll go whore hopping. Oh, what a splendid idea. I think I'll join you. Do you know, Yardley, I haven't exercised my badge of pleasure for many a month. I will just have to lift you on again. Oh, now, that's not very Hey, Jack, what was the name of that skinny one you fixed me up with? Helen Mildred? Well, that is. Christ, she was a lively bit of crumpy. She does marvellous things to your ass. Oh, it's like being dead. You know, paradise. Come on, Yatesy. Good night, Jacko. Good night, Yatesy. <laughs> I, I, I suppose I'm just not a bad person. <laughs> I don't know about that. You did all right. Nah. Jack Flowers here tonight. Jack, you here? He's here. You Jack Flowers? Yeah, that's right. Friend told me to look you up. Uh-huh. Said you could help me out with something special. How much you want to spend? What did 50 get me? Get your dick. What? Get you nothing. Well, how much then? 400 Singapore. That's almost 150 US. Uh huh. Is it for two? Much as you can handle, Buster. Okay. Want to take cool. along, William? Uh, but, well, just for a while. Here you go, Wally. Thank, Thank you, Dick. You're welcome, Wally. Good night, Dick. Good night, Wally. What are we drinking here? Beer, beer, Sonny. Yeah. Beer, three beers. No food. Okay. Here, take your choice. Hi, Jack. Hey, Rika, sweetheart, how are you? Where's Bridget? Bridget here tonight? Yeah, just meeting. I get for you. Good. Who's Bridget? 
That one. She's beautiful. Oh, yeah, you made a great choice. Yeah, it's a vibrator. Pussy cat. You boys want to buy anything? Yeah. Any mom? No, no. Fred. Fred, take your monk and go home, huh? Give my love to your kids. Hey, how you doing, Max? Well, I'll be damned. You got a new line, don't you, Max? Where'd you get this stuff? <laughs> yeah, I know. Take it home, Max. No sale. Hey, honey, what are you drinking? Good evening, gentlemen. Hot chocolate. Hot chocolate, Sonny. Welcome to Singapore. Thank you. Do you like this tea in Singapore? Oh, they love it, don't you, Phil? Yeah, yes, fascinating. You're English? Yes, I am. Oh, I'm very interested in Englishmen. Oh, really? I hope they can. You're, um, you're, you're Chinese? Yes, I'm Chinese. Were you born here in Singapore? Yeah, I'm born in Singapore, live in Singapore, die in Singapore. Bridget, honey, a friend of mine from the U.S. thinks you're very beautiful. Oh, you're American? Yes. I'm very interested in American men. Isn't it getting kind of late? I'll let the lady have a hot joke. It's all right, Jack. Your friend is in station. That's very good. We have an angel here. Why don't you get the taxi? Hello, how are you doing, Mike? Okay, what? honey, I'll do that. Oh, no, thank you. Sonny, forget the beer. What do I owe you? $20? No beer, $20. What if you gave us a beer? What does it cost? All right. I'll see you soon. Very sexy guy. Jack, I never see you anymore. Helene, Helene, Helene. Women here are also attractive. They're all guys. Neighborhood. You live here? Are you kidding me? Where else? Yeah, yeah boy, keep it down, huh? Jack. Mommy, I'm here. I'm here. Oh, hey, buddy. Hold on. Charming house. Right up the stairs, gentlemen. Those operations must be very expensive. Oh, yes, it's very expensive. Well, she saved up for eight years. Where is it you went, honey? Hamburg. Where are you going, Lily? Copenhagen. Oh, yeah? Copenhagen. Oh.
Hello, Jack. Why is the matter? Don't you need a show? Terrific. Here, this is for you. You want tea? You got something stronger? Scotch. Scotch is good. You're looking beautiful. Thank you. friend is, um... <laughs> yeah, personally, I find it all rather touching. Like a couple of puppies gambling in the grass. I'm not sure about the music. Yeah, well, don't get too comfortable. We'll be down in five minutes. Five minutes? Jack? Yeah? You want a soda? Uh, make it neat. No permanent drink? Uh, no, thanks. Why is it so quiet tonight? The police making trouble on me. You're not paying off? Every week. So? Four of it. One forget pay police, another forget pay gangster. No more money left. Well, you just bring them around, Mammy. You see what I do. Jack? Hey, try it. Yeah, a lot of small time punks shaking people down, trying to scare them. Cool tower. Oh, thank you. Thanks, sweetheart. Cool tower. Uh, n no, thank you. All set, pal? Yes, can we go now? Yeah, why not? Let us out, Mammy. Yeah? Where you want to go, Jack? You got a date? Yeah, that's right. Very nice to meet you. Good night. Good night. I'll see you, Mammy. Jack? Yeah? yeah. You be careful. Fix up this photo, that photo, okay? House? Don't worry about me, sweetheart. Mister, I hope you enjoy the rest of your cruise. Thanks, Jack. You're ever in Philadelphia, look me up. Name's Milton. George Milton. No, it's not Stanley, and you're out of Baltimore. Hello. Yeah. Right Got everybody to Singapore in the first place. <laughs> Ever think of going back home, I mean? Uh, William, it's a long way to Tipperary. <laughs> hey, fellas. Having a nice evening? We're going to Prince's now. Not very friendly. Competition never is, so let's walk fast. Huh? Let's walk fast. Yeah. 
Friday away. We got a lot of speed. <laughs> oh, my legs are getting out. Oh, sit down, will you? Where the hell is Mr. Gunstock? Oh, it's take a long time for on Yeah, I know. Hey, Jack, come here. I've got a present for you. I need a present. This better be good. Monica. Monica, a nun, huh? A nun? Don't go away, honey. Turn in, old man. Okay, William, you do that. Who's this good looking friend, Jack? Very subtle, Judy. He is. My girl, Friday, William, most honest woman I ever met. <laughs> ah, you too. He's very cute. Maybe two girls. Uh, well, I promised my lady wife I'd give her a ring, but. Uh, mm. Thank you for a most entertaining evening. A little jet lag, are we? Well, just a bit. I'll be as bright as button in the morning. Excuse me. Ah, oh, Mr. Gunstone, Colonel, sir, how are you? Thanks how are you? Good. Yes, please, Mark. Been on the tiles? I sure have, Colonel. Got something for you. Yeah. I know you're a rather splendid place for this. I hope that makes me a life member. It sure does, Colonel. You want a receipt or something for this? No, don't bother. Uh, coming no, my I'll way? Coming my way, way no, thank you. How about you, Jack? Oh, I have a date, Colonel. Anyone I know? I don't even know her. Oh, how splendid. Taxi's here, Colonel. Uh, how's Mrs. Gunstone, Colonel? Thank you, Jack. She's well and she sends best regards. Oh, well, you send her my Where's best regards. Where's that little car of yours? Well, it's, uh, I sold it. It's always in the shop anyway, Kurt. Always the way, but there's little French cars, four weapons. Good night, Jack. Good night, Jack. Good night, You Italian? Yeah, that's right. Italian. Good lover, bad husband. Yeah? Yeah. That's what my mother always said. Many <laughs> That's right, it's a walk up. Oh! God damn it, sorry. Hate sorry. Why the hell are you wearing? Man like. Stupid. Get a little over to cook your tree. Okay, this way. Jerry, you want two vegan Sundays? No, Esther, not tonight. Just some coffee. Oh. What about you, Monica? What are you drinking? You have tea? No tea, coffee only. Don't like coffee. What kind of a girl don't like coffee? This kind of a girl don't oh. like coffee. I like Coke. Okay, Coke. Coke? Okay. Coke. 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 That's right. Play my job. Play my job, Esther. Bali. Uh-huh. Biden's devil. So they say. Hey. Yeah. You have a fucker or you just steal her food? I don't know why you put up with it. Beautiful. Well, you like it? Take it. No, no. All right, then don't take it.
kidding me. What are you doing with the Bobsy twins? Well, they simply don't trust that English sheet. How the hell with them? Finish up tomorrow. Mr. Hing, I assure you it is all in order. Famous Oriental politeness. Awesome, isn't it? Has he spit yet? And not for an hour. Well, he will in a minute. Probably huck a Louie on your shoe. Well, I'm very agile. Yeah, I know. Have you finished, lah? Men before need three days. Price, you finished already? Yeah, they got me a seat on the nine o'clock. Yes, it is all done, Mr. Hing. You tell us Hong Kong, everything okay here. Oh, you don't want the man to lie, do you? Why'd you stay on there? Keep my visa. I can't exactly go to the immigration and say occupation running a wang house. <laughs> uh, what about that Tao Kei of yours in Hong Kong? Oh, well, actually, he's um, a cunt. A call of the East, indeed. God. Still, it won't be much longer. Huh? Yeah. Margaret's been left a small Georgian house in the West Country. Oh, that's nice. Yes, it really is delightful. We'll be going there soon, and it's got some very good trout fishing attached to it. Whenever I get uptight about being stuck out here, I think of the fish rising in Gloucestershire. <laughs> and it makes me feel calm again for some reason. I can't wait to put myself out to pasture. Oh, you're not ready for that yet, how old are you? I'm 51. Oh. Well, me, I just want a yacht, big mansion. Uh, Peacock or something in the garden, you know? <laughs> Walk around all day with a bowl of hats, silk pajamas, play golf, smoke real Havanas. And who knows? I'll be a son of a bitch. They tell me they're raiding princes now. Too accommodating, that's why they killed him. Trying to hang a sign on me. Stay away. I should forget about that house of yours, Jack. But it doesn't strike me as a very popular idea amongst the Chinese community. You want to check out? Leave it for a while at least, don't you think? You gotta miss your plane. See you next year. Silk
Hey, Judy, where's Jack? Nothing, I'm just looking for Jack. I'll say anything. Can I help you? No, no, I'm good to talk to Jack. Now, the Chinese, they go for Australian girls. You know, big boned. The Germans usually go for Tamils. The English, they don't give a damn as long as they're young and boyish. Isn't that right, Colonel? In Juba. <laughs> yeah, for the Americans, they do a lot of hugging up in taxis. You know? When they go home, they write letters. Girls are always after me to help them answer them. How splendid. <laughs> say, Jack, can I see you in a minute? Yeah, sure. Excuse me, will you, Colonel? Pour some champagne, will you, Gunner? What's the matter, fella? Jack, I can't screw that girl. Now, why is that, Floyd? I never could screw girls. It's bullshit. Uh -huh. Bullshit this, bullshit that. Turns me right off the first thing. Yeah, I know what you mean. Uh, we're right here, boy. Wang Mei! Boy's hungry? Get him something to eat, will you, honey? Mm. See that guy back there? Yes. Well, you're new at this and you don't speak English. Groovy. Jack, telephone. Yes, sir. Hey, Mr. Tan, how's business? Business terrible, Jack. Oh, yeah, why is that? My son is a Chinese idiot. Yeah. What? Who? Oh, yeah, I remember you, pal. Well, that's easy. You take a left past the old Methodist church, we're half a mile on your right. Yeah, okay. You so. The guy at the end of the bar, isn't he, my girl? He has a drink, and his eggs old. Oh, yeah, it's good taste. Take care of him, Nancy, he's unhappy. It makes me happy. Good night, Jack. Yeah, I'll see you, pal. Who's outside? Okay, okay, Jack. I'm a dog. I'm here to bark. Too much garlic. A little. Yeah, a little. Jack, just a little. Uh, what do you think? I like garlic. You want to eat that? No, too early, yes. You always early. You must eat. If you don't eat, you die. Yeah, I know, huh? I know, I know. Are you depressed about something, kid? My boyfriend making trouble on me. Oh, you got a new boyfriend. Same my friend. I thought you dropped that guy. I had no time for him. He was all day, I was all night. Why don't you give him a present? Present? Yeah. 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 Give him this. Close in the dark. Looking cigar, Cuban. Yeah. Indonesian, made of paper. I'll try one of these. Ah, thanks. Smoke it after dinner. Jack? Yeah. You know him, too? Oh, yeah, I know him. Hi, Henry. They're OK, honey. Good evening. Good evening. Beautiful. Where's she from? Ceylon. Ceylon. Yeah. They call it Sri Lanka now. Yeah, I know. Screwed up all the names. Zanzibar, the Congo, Siam, Persia, all gone. Millions of people were killed because of that fucking thing. Just a minute, huh? Yeah, sure. What are you doing wearing that for Christ's sake? Answer me! Take it easy, Buster. Take it easy yourself. What the hell you let her wear that for? It's an old Buddha symbol. What? Stands for peace, love, and happiness. Oh? Really? Yeah, that's right. The prick didn't even invent that. Honestly, Jacko, how can you expect me to pierce the valley of pleasure with all this noise going on? It upsets my concentration. We're sorry, Froggy, aren't we, pal? Yeah, uh, sorry. Buy him a drink, honey. Well, uh, it's all very well, you know, Jacko, but this evening has been a long upward climb, and now I've tumbled to the bottom. Everything is a lot of milk no, no, I'm climb. hungry. Where will it end, Jack? Where will it end? You're crying again, Smelly. He's not crying, Jacko. He is pissed. Oh, keep it down, can't you, Froggy? Oh, keep it down. I've been trying all night to keep it up. Oh, steady, dear. How tall are you, Mr. Froggy? Oh, about six foot four, my dear. Oh, tall enough to kiss an elephant's balls. <laughs> Judy, Judy. Hey, Jack. Come on, have a look at this place. How long have you been out? A couple of months. We're not in the yellow pages yet. Why the hell did you call it down the room? Why the hell not? I hope. Hey, Mac. Jack, telephone. Put her on hold. Is it even so soon? Well, I saw what I came to see. What's that? You, Jack. Oh, you got me all wrong, sweetheart. <laughs> I have something for you I think you'll like. Ti chiamo. OK, pal. What are you, Italian? The name's Schumann. Eddie Schumann.
William Lee, Jesus Christ. Where the hell are you calling from? You're here. Oh, it is, isn't it? I don't know where it went. So, how you doing? Couldn't be better. Look, why don't you hop in the cab and get over here? Oh, you work too hard, William. Okay. Okay, I'll pick you up around 5 o'clock. Good. So let me have a scotch, will you? And what'd you do with that cigar? Long enough for both of us. Hey, Jack. See you soon, boys. Bye. Hurry up. Fuck him. Fuck him? Just get Mr. Lee out. Bye, Mr. Hurry up, will you? Yankee, go home. Hey, man. Where you from? Buffalo. How about you, Red? Houston. Memphis. Uh, Which top falls? Two men from Texas. How do you stand them? It ain't easy. <laughs> Where are your station? Dene. Uh, rough. Yeah. Yeah. Been there? No, I'm a little too old. Korea. No shit, my old man was in Korea. Got a couple of fingers blown off. Yeah? Well, how long are you boys gonna be here? Going to Bangkok tomorrow. R&R. &R. One whole week. Oh, you're gonna love it. You're gonna love it. Gotta get yourself a Thai massage. You know what that is? What the hell is that? Well, that's where two women soap themselves up. One works the front, the other works the back. You're a sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> Now, let me hold you up, boys. Have See fun. You. See ya. Yeah. Hello, Jack. William. Sorry to keep you waiting. Oh, don't worry about it. <laughs> up in. Huh. Well, any peacocks in the garden yet? Well, I'm working on it. How long are you staying this time? Oh, I'm doing a rather leisurely order, giving myself a night or two in the town. That's the spirit. You know, when I thought about that night in Singapore, I felt as though I must have dreamt it. Oh, you didn't get to play any squash. Well, I'm gone off squash a bit. What's going on over there? Vice raid. Perhaps they're behind on the payments. Hypocrites. Jack slumming. <laughs> You're looking good. Don't sound so surprised. Cigarettes, are they? How are the kids? Oh, they're fine. They still ask about you. Oh, yeah? No kidding. It's been two years. That long? That long. Huh. Well, I started feeling kind of funny about it again. Funny? Yeah. Thought to myself, this is getting to be too regular. Like being married. You know how I feel about that. Yes, it, it ruins, ruins your sense of humor. Right. I should have called you, Katie. Yes, you should have. Come on, William. You should feel right at home here. Huh? Oh, yeah, they. Dear departed days of empire. New Singapore slings. And a glass of water. A glass of water. Yeah, Jacko. Yeah, pull up a pew. We're celebrating our 23rd. Oh, yeah? Well, happy day. 
fourthly. Sit down with him. Mrs. Yancey, you're looking more beautiful than ever. Thank you, John. You always exaggerate. <laughs> Haven't we met? Oh, William Lee. L-E-I-G-H. Oh, yes. John? Yeah? Did you know Henry and I first met here? No kidding. At the Palm Court? Well, I'll be. I was standing on that piano at the time, I believe. I was as drunk as a lord. <laughs> but he was so dashing in his uniform. Oh, very was. Well, were you stationed in the... Royal Navy. Oh, of course. Now, the Royal Malaysian Navy. They're wearing our uniforms. Are they? Are they? Come the three corners of the world in arms, and we shall shock them. Right. Henry is very well read. Oh, I know he is. Isn't this where Kipling and Morm and all those writer fellows used to hang out? Oh, yeah, that's right. Mrs. Yates, I ever tell you about my days as a writer? I don't believe so, John. No? Well, I was knocking around the world, you know? And then one day, uh, in Manila, I think, I was down on my luck and broke, went to see about this job on a ship, and the skipper asked me what I did. I said, I'd do anything, but I'm really a writer. He says, oh, you write, do you? I said, yes, sir. He said, well, pick up that pad and pencil. So I pick up the pad and pencil. He says, right. I said, shoot. He said, carrots, 400 pounds, flour, 80 pounds. Ah, <laughs> huh? here we go. William, you ever taste a single porcelain? I'll be right back. Did I say something wrong? No. Uh, he forgot his pills. Yes. William? You got your pills. Oh, yeah. And the heat must have brought it on. What is it, your ticker? It monkey. Well, why don't I call you a doctor? No, really. Oh, look, I know I think I've better just lie down. OK, let me give you a hint. So embarrassing. What's so embarrassing? Why didn't you tell me you didn't feel good? Look, let me just take a taxi. I'll be all what right. What are you talking about? Mr. William Lee, Hong Kong, one night. Give me the key, fast. The register, sir. What? Well, man doesn't feel well. Come on. Look, please, Jack, let me. Don't forget about it. Tax deductible. I'm ten. This is quite unnecessary. All right, here we go. This is so silly. All right, we'll get you in some nice air conditioning. You're terribly sorry. Quit apologizing in fucking English national pastime. So all we got left. Uh, <laughs> all right, which way? Come on, William. Okay. Uh, this is very grand. Oh, that lovely chill. Thanks. <coughs> you can bring the baggage, sir? No, no bags. What are you smiling at? I think so. Here, get the hell out of here. Uh, thanks for a couple of boys in heat. Oh, very fast, your reputation. Yeah. Nothing else I can bring you? No, thanks. I'm feeling much better. I just need to cool my uh, ticker, as you call it. OK, William. Did I hold him? I'll visit your place tomorrow. Any time, any time. You try to get some sleep, and you call me if you need anything. Oh, I will, I will. You've been very kind. Shut up and sleep. Thank you very much. And I say you will call him back. Okay, that's good. I'll give me a little more, will you? I got my eye on you. So watch your step. Want some tea, girl? 
shooting me. Rosie! Huh? Don't you know any other songs, for Christ's sake? Of course, no sweat! <laughs> Come on, sing! Sing! Ah! <laughs> Sleep a little longer, honey. It's still early. Okay. No sweat. Yusuf. Yusuf, come here. Get the girls inside, and nobody comes downstairs. I mean, nobody. Hey, dengar, dengar, perempuan, perempuan, dengar. Dengar, ya? Jimmy, Jimmy! You and Esther in the kitchen. And stay there. Close, fellas. Why don't you come back after seven? You care to buy some interesting book, Mr. Flower? What are you selling? Special bizarre sex material, Swedish. Swell. Anything else I can do for you boys? You positive you don't care to buy them, Mr. Frawl? I'll take a dozen. How much? For you, cheap. We have a bus station in the car. Could you care to choose? You choose them. Oh, Mr. Flower, everybody has their own preference in sex. I like this. Maybe you don't like. All right, boys, let's get it over with before I drop kick this little cocksucker down the hill. Scare me. Get inside. That's to take her inside. No, they'll kill you. Get her out of here. I think you should choose your book, Mr. Frower. Looks that way. Here to <clears throat> Get yourself a drink, buddy. See you later.
Bell County. Jimmy, where are the girls? They all right? Everybody sleeps. Gangster come back. Take everything. Destroy everything. Yeah, you got a drink? You bet. <whistles> yeah, you bet, Jack. Ah, they just run all over me, that's all. You want something to eat? No, no. Jesus Christ, Jack. Read me what it says, Jimmy. Just read the words. I am poisoned and dead. Uh -huh. Remove this, you die. Yeah, right. Read good face. <laughs> Worst boy. What? Worst boy, like son of prostitute. <laughs> Curse of dog shit. <laughs> I know, but will you wait? Not dollar. Oh, all right. But, uh, but will you wait? I just want to see if he's here. Better wait one month, then come back. Oh, uh, let's go, Harry. Let's get the show on the road, huh? We'll huddle. Maybe you should wait, Glitter Hills. Don't you have a plane to catch? No, right. don't worry. Oh, no, don't worry about it, Harry. You just, uh, you just uh, do a little bit, because I want to see the quality of your work. Quality depend on money. Money's no object, Harry. You know that. That was the difference. I'm broke anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Quiet. So what's the choice, Harry? What do we got what here? What do you like? Well, what do you got? Huh? Oh. Well, well, what do you think? Oh my God! I don't know. I mean, it's not like choosing a tie, is it? Uh, I'll tell you what, Harry. Give me the flowers over Can there. Do. Everything, flowers. Yeah, it's a good idea. You know, vines, leaves, calcium areas. I'm going <laughs> to miss you, William. Thank you. <laughs> you know how Singapore got its name, William? Uh-huh. Well, uh, there was nothing but jungle, you know. Yeah. Nobody ever crossed over. Mm. Then one day, this uh, Hindu prince 
He rolls over with a big bunch of people, a hunting party. You know. They're going to shoot some deer, bows and arrows, all that. And uh, they traipse around a while. And wait a minute. What do they spot? What? A tiger. Then they spot another tiger. And then some more tigers. They're up to their asses in tigers. <laughs> so they run. They run like hell, you know. They hop back in their boats, they row away, and the prince says, boy, that place is something. I'm going to name it. I'm going to call it Singapore, Lion City. Lion City! Oh, I thought you said they were tigers. Well, that's right. That's right. That's the point of the story, William. The dummy couldn't tell a tiger from the lion. That's <laughs> very funny. So what can you expect? place that got started like that. Quite. Huh? Hey, uh, uh, Harry, how long is this going to take? Oh, nine. Yeah, well, you better get out of here. You got a plane to catch. I think I'll wait. Get the fuck out of here. All right. Oh, I can't shake hands. See you next year. Yeah. Sure. See you next year. Harry, 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 Harry. Hey, you do this for a living? Thanks, Harry. I'll see you. Be careful, Jay. Yeah. Mr. Schumann asked me to pick you up. He'd like you to have lunch with him. Is it air conditioned? Yes, sir. Okay, then. How old are you, kid? 21, sir. Any action? No, sir. I just drive for Mr. Schumann, sir. Uh -huh. Oh, where you been lately? Uh, Mr. Schumann asked me to give you a box of his cigars. He said he knows you'll enjoy them. Schumann, should I wait? Why don't you go, uh, Marvin? Jack, have a seat, will you? Sit down. Henry? Choyome? Huh? How's it going, honey? My tea. Hello, darling. Fast work already. How'd you find me? Top secret. Here, have some of this. I'll have a beer. Hello, Jack. Hi. Bobby, when'd you get in? Yesterday. Tonight I've come to Dun Rome. Oh, you're too late, pal. They closed me down. Oh, no. Come to net out Amsterdam. Yeah. And you? New Amsterdam. New York. Ever been to uh, Amsterdam, Jack? Not yet. Uh, they're very subtle over there. The uh, the girls sit in shop windows, you know, with red lights burning, right? Yeah. Yeah. In case you missed the point. It's a bit tidy. See you later. See you later. That's all right, Robbie. You take care now. Henry. Speak Chinese too. Or Cantonese. You speak Italian? Yeah. Some. Sure. The name's Giovanni Fiore. John Flowers. First generation. Yeah, that's right. Born Buffalo, New York, August 28, 1931. Now, eat that, darling. That's very good. I don't like with a head on. The head is the best part. I don't like. Fought in Korea. <coughs> Purple Heart. Went to college on the GI Bill. Majored in English Lit. Why'd you quit writing? I didn't know enough. 59, you left the States. Shipped out on a freighter bound for Jakarta, and then? What are you, in the CIA? There was a general in the Civil War. Thought it'd be a very good idea if his men had a little sexual activity to relieve the... So, he went to Lincoln, and he convinced him to send a bunch of girls up to the front. Now, this general's name was Hooker. 
Oh, yeah? Yeah. Well, the Army's still in the cat house business, Jack, but I guess you wouldn't be interested in that. Have you the one about the guy with the rash on his arm? Goes to a skin doctor, they try everything. Creams, ointments, injections, no go. Finally, he goes to a specialist in Copenhagen. The doctor asks him, what do you do for a living? The guy says, I work in the circus. I give enemas to elephants. The thing is, you give an enema to an elephant, you have to shove your arm up its ass. The doctor says, that's it. You give up your job, I guarantee you the rash will go away. The guy says, what, you give up show business? We don't smoke marijuana in the city. We don't take our trips on LSD. We don't burn our crap cars down on Main Street. We like living around, being free. We don't Forty <laughs> Come on, boys. Come on. Come on, help me break it out. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Come on, break it out. Hey, hey, hey. Come on. Oh, please, please. You think I need a drink, will you? Tell Hing no more Australian beef. No Australian? Prime US. Prime your ass. Probably not even Australian. Probably Malaysian. No cow in Malaysia. What? No cows in Malaysia. Yeah, that's right. Jimmy, come here. What are you I selling Jack. smack to these kids? Smack? Heroin. No, no, Jack. Catch you selling heroin, you're out on your ass. No, no. You old-fashioned Jack. I don't know what I am, but one more time, I'm going to kill you. Give me a minute. I'll think of it. Christ, I can see his goddamn face. What do you got, the day off? You wake up a wrong bit, one? Yeah, I know. How's it going, kid? He's in love. Oh, God. Huh? Wait a minute. You mean dog trap. No, not dog trap. That big guy you saw Philip Pelly. Yeah, I know the guy you mean. Say, how's that fucker's name? He got a clap in Bangkok. That's the one. Blonde. He got killed, didn't he? Fuck yeah. Took a fucking mortar right in the back of the head. What was his name? That was that guy, Lone Star. You fucking with us now, man. Lone Star. Fucking Lone Star in the hospital in Tokyo getting blown. Who the fuck cares who the fuck it was? Hey, Flowers, what asshole talking all them tattoos? Well, I'll tell you the truth, fellas. I had this long phone call once. Started doodling. Ran out of paper. <laughs> hey, Adam! Hey, you got a joint? Oh, come on, give me a joint.
two rooms. Let's go. Party's over, guys. Hey, flowers, get your ass over here. Hey, the flowers. Hey, I'm coming. Who the hell are you talking about? I don't know what you're talking about. You know what they're hey, talking about? Ain't that guy from Mississippi? No, no, you know that crazy motherfucker that rigged the grenade in the shit house. Oh, yeah, he's really crazy. Old Mel went to go take a piss and got the shit blown out of him. Yeah, the command tried to blame it on Charlie. It ain't nothing new there, man. Hey, pass that joint. Can't you just see Charlie digging up there to rig one shit out? Billy, have a toe. No. <laughs> Fucking command's crazy anyway. No shit. Well, from the last two hours on, we had goddamn orders not to shoot back going through villages. I mean, what the fuck? Hey, can't man, you can't shoot. What are we here for? Join. I've shit. been waiting all day. Mr. Flowers has been rolling. Mr. Schumann is in your office. Okay. Shit. See you later, boys. Where the hell are you going? Crap. Up their ass, man. Come on, man. We have a toe. No, no, I don't want to stop. Not allowed to. No, no. Not allowed in Singapore. No shit, man. <laughs> hey, Eddie. You can't win here. Jack, you eat. Oh, no, thanks. You must eat. If not, you die, you know? I know, I know. Those are for you. No kidding. Thanks a lot. There's a couple of bigwigs coming through town tomorrow. Yeah? So? Well, one of them swings the other way. Buy me something, will you? Huh? Jack. Yeah? Shelly said, pissed off. She's going home. I said, are you kidding me? She said she's going home anyway. Hello, Eddie. What's the matter, Hello, Eddie? Who the hell knows with Shelly? Ah, let her go. Ah, uh, let her go. What about him? Fuck him. You fucker. You gonna dig me up a boy, Jack? Help out the army? Call Mammy Lum. She handles boys. Okay. She can handle this place, too. We're in the slaughterhouse business, Eddie. We're the ones who fatten them up. Yeah, I know. Like the man said, never touch shit, even with gloves on. Yeah, that's right. Hey, you still can't get these in the States? Yeah, I know. Ever since Kennedy and Casper, you can't get a good cigar in America. One. Looks that way. Mr. Jack. Mr. Jack. Hey, the goat. Mr. Jack. Don't 
after you in a long time. Yeah, I know. How's our friend Hink? Mask him. Want that medicine, Mr. Jack? Yeah. Medicine is good. You got some stash to wait? Yeah, just a second. Body play around with death. Take my glove. Go, good. I'm gonna get shit kicked by Vitcom. Yeah, that's right. No more money, Uncle Sam. Better you go home. I'm thinking about it. Go home, where Buffalo roam. I'm gonna miss you, Smiley. William. Hello, Josh. William. What are you doing, Hing? The man looks exhausted. Let him out of his cell, will you? You're gonna have to finish tomorrow, Mr. Hing. Okay, okay, eight o'clock. Nothing ever changes, eh, William? No, nothing ever does. Thanks, Dopey. See you around. <laughs> you never change. Wait here a minute, will you, William? Let me have a drink, Tommy. I like it. Came out good, huh? You got licks too. Yeah, that's right. How would you like one of them up your ass? Kalan Chong. He hasn't arrived yet, I see. Still early, yes. Scotch and uh, what the hell are you doing? I must pray. Uh, yeah, sure. What are you going to do, Jack? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> something, will, something will turn up. You'll be going back <coughs> soon anyway. Margaret's getting a bit restless. What are you going to do? Going to retire? Throw roses? Huh? <laughs> yeah, maybe that Schumann fella could put you in touch with some real money and you could go home. Yeah, uh, well, maybe. You've seen what can happen out here. These old angbos drifting from day to day. No job, no visas. I mean, the cool is the better. I'll be all right, will you? Scotch, Pemmers Pink. Just to know when to quit. <laughs> oh, is it best? Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello Jack O. Hello, Jack O. Pity about your recent fiasco, Jack. Hardly surprising, though. They didn't tattoo Again. you again, did they, Jacko? Oh, there there is fellow countryman, you silly sod. A typical American fiasco, don't you think so, Lee? Absolutely. Basically a nation of amateur pulses from their president down. All the way down to Jacko. Trying to run the world like a bloody bordello. I'm making such a bulls of it. <laughs> <laughs> Any comments, Mr. Lee? Any questions? I'll be right back. You all right, will you? It's next to the food. You can't miss it. <laughs> yes, I know. Thank you. I never ordered beer, Warner. These gentlemen may drink beer, but you know perfectly well that I never drink beer on a Wednesday. It's nice and warm, is it, Wallow? On Wednesdays, I always drink a froggit. Froggit? Froggit. Froggit? Yes. I'll <laughs> tell you what a froggit is. It's a large gin, kiss of lime, ton of ice, big glass soda. Gems! Now, oh, Wally, listen, it's perfectly simple if you concentrate. Large gin, kiss of lime, ton of ice, big glass, soda. 
Gin tonic. Oh, apparently that's all I'm going to get. It's not like this back home, is it, Smell? Oh, what you forget is this used to be home. Yeah, what happened to all that? You gave it all back to them. And were they grateful? No. No, you weren't grateful, were you, Wally? Huh? This royal throne of kings, this sceptered isle, this earth of majesty, this seat of Mars, this blessed plot, this earth, this England, this other king. Can you hear me, William? You want me to call a doctor? He said. Wally, will you turn that thing off for Christ's sake? Call a doctor. Get me some help. Hurry up. Wait, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute now. You just lean on me, huh? Lean on me. Lean on me. You're gonna be all right. You're right, mate. All right, step down here, will you? That's right. You'll be all right, sport. Here we go. Does he want his drink? That's the Dong Yang Yuan Jiu Sang. There you go. Here we are. That's right. That's right. Easy, that's it. Let's sit him down here. Okay. Okay. Where's the medic? Is he all right? All right. Grab his legs. Grab his legs! William? Come on, William. Come on, William. Come on, William. He's gone, Jacko. Time's the funeral. Cloak and dagger, Eddie. Why couldn't you talk to me on the phone? There's a guy going to Saigon next week. Check out the withdrawal. Politician. Family man, couple of kids. Democrat. Yeah, so? Well, some people think he's too opinionated. They'd like something to put him in his place. Like what? Pictures, tapes. Whatever. <laughs> A minute there, I thought you were going to ask me to kill him. You're not that desperate, are you? Well, some people, when they're desperate, they think about suicide. Me, I'm different. I think about murder. The whole island used to be like this, you know that? Uh-huh. Ten degrees cooler, too. Uh-huh. So what do you say? Who well, names the price? Go ahead. It stinks, Eddie, you know that. Expenses now, 25,000 on delivery. I could use a drink. Good piece of change, Jack, 25 grand. Give you a chance to go home. Sunshine. Very good. 
You're very lucky too. Got a new job, no? Make some bread, huh? Yeah, that's right. And did those feet in ancient time walk upon England's mountains green? And was the holy Lamb of God on England's pleasant pastures seen? And did the Hope it doesn't rain. Won't rain for an hour or so. What about the remains, Jack? I'll handle it. The king's got to get off. I'll handle it. Let's go for a drink. The day is a dead loss anyway. No point in going to work now. Can't somebody stop those bastards? You guys go ahead. I'll see you later. Nice to amaze the gods. Very lucky to make noise. Also to make devils peace off. Yeah, let me have a scotch. Make it a double, yes. will you? You know what I find so luxurious about Singapore? It's the exotic atmosphere. Exotic name, and yet everyone speaks English. It's rather like having a cake and eating it, too. All the mysteries of the East, all the comforts of the West. Hey, no wonder we can't get you out of here. Yes, sir, it was so boring. I prefer Paris. <laughs> well, yes, Nina, you in Paris. Nina always wants to be someplace else. Don't we all, Jim? Hmm. Yes, but not tonight, Eddie. You're sweet. You know that? <laughs> Good afternoon, sir. Thank you for coming to enjoy this evening. Absolutely well. Thank you, Gary. I we'll recommend it. Enjoy it. So you're from Singapore, Nina? Yes, I'm from Singapore, and my parents from Singapore, too. All my grandparents are not from Singapore. <laughs> so where are your grandparents from? Different. Oh, really? That's interesting. A little mini United Nations all over yourself. Well, thanks for a most entertaining evening, Eddie. Though I must say it had very little to do with you. Oh, Senator, I think we have to thank Eddie for bringing us together. <laughs> Excuse me. I'll see you at 8 in the morning, Jim. Fine, Eddie. Good night, Nina. Good night, Senator. Watch your step. <laughs>
sir. You want a nice girl tonight? No, thank you. Give me a room number. I'll send her up to your room. I said no, thank you. Thank you. I'm just down for a walk. Don't you have a nice time, Carl? Home. Nice and tall. Safe hotel. Right? Well, I think I should go in and uh, get us a key. Why don't you wait here and I'll just like get you out of the house? Fine. What's your name, kid? Tony, but I'm busy. Yeah, I know. What's the room number? What are you, police? Yeah. It's 250. Count it. All right, now give it back. What's the room number? One one five three. Another two fifty. Leave the door open. Don't worry, nobody's gonna get hurt.
on in. Swan? Out here, pal. Morning, morning, Carl. Pictures ready, Swan? Cassie make pics, they come out good. Thanks, pal. You leave Singapore at one? Yes, so. It's too much, Tuan. It's nothing here, sir. It's money. Some of it's handy, no, it's one. Some of things are one. Yeah, you too. Would you give me Hong Kong again? Number, please. 388-471. Thank you. Yeah. Hello. Mrs. Lee? Yes. Mr. William Lee? Yes. I'm Jack Flowers. I'm calling from Singapore. Hope I didn't wake you. No. Oh, that's good. Well, I've been trying to call, but no answer. Well, I can avoid answer. Yeah, I can understand that. Oh, the funeral. Went okay, ma'am. Yeah. Just like that. Me, I work for Hing. Yeah, I know him. A little bit. I have his ashes here. I thought I'd drop by Hong Kong. Oh, that's far too much trouble. No, it's right on my way. No, no, really. There's no trouble. I prefer you just post them. Are you sure? Oh, don't mention it, Mrs. Lee. I'd rather not see you. Okay. Good night, Mrs. Lee. Goodbye. You going somewhere? Sri Lanka, Colombo, home. You go to America, bye bye. I go to Ceylon. So long, Belle. What are you sore about? Who said I'm sore? I'm happy. Now I got some money. I buy myself a rich boy. In Singapore, men buy the woman. In Ceylon, women buy the men. Better in Ceylon. So long, kid. So long, kid. Tough gun. I look for you in Ceylon. Yeah, sure. Stupid. Send this register. Any insurance, sir? Yeah, I guess so. Value? What's your top? A thousand dollars. Yeah, so how much? Five dollars. Postage is six eighty. It's eleven eighty. Insurance name? Mrs. William Lee. Name is right here. Address to. Contents? Just personal effects. For job?
Charlie, how's it going? Back again, huh? How's business? Give you none, drinking dessert. 